Hey guys, so today I'm gonna be showing y'all how to make a GUI, a screen, a uh, start menu GUI like this. Let me just show it to y'all. Below, so settings, you can go back to menu. There's a little nice transition. Then the play button just goes up. And then this already covered in another video. So let's get into it. So the first thing that you're gonna need to do is go to start a GUI. Then make a make a screen GUI like this. A screen GUI. Okay. Put it in the start GUI. Name it intro. Or you can name it whatever you want. But this is just for the intro. Okay, so you're gonna name it intro. You're gonna add a bool value. Okay. Once you add the bool value, name it open. Okay. If you name it something else, then it's not going to work. The scripts aren't going to work because the scripts have a... Uh, just just trust me. Alright, name it open. And then you're going to add a frame. Which this frame is going to be this, this frame. The back frame that you see right there, the blue one. And then in that frame, you're going to add two buttons. Or you can add a third button. You can add a third button for like an about or something else. I don't know. For your other games. Or shout outs for the shop if you want it here in the start. So for the first button, this is gonna be the play button. So you're gonna do the play button. Also put a title if you want. Nothing goes in the title, that's just the title, you know. Alright, so in the play button, you're gonna add a sound. And in the sound, you gotta name it click sound. C O I C K Capital S O U N D exactly like that and then the the sound id is going to be 504117166 this is the sound you can change it and use your own if you want it's going to be whenever you click something so then you're going to add two local scripts on the first local script you're going to put this um script in here just um copy it okay you can pause the video and on the second one which this one is the Sound play script. This is sound play script. Just copy it, pause the video, put it down. So those are the only two scripts. Those are the only scripts that you need on the play button. And then you can make the play button however you want. That's just normal customization. You don't need nothing in that. Okay, you can exit all that. Then the other the other button, which is the settings menu, the settings button for me. Um, in that in that button, you're gonna put two local scripts and a sound. And in the sound. It's the same thing as the play button. This is the sound ID, and you're gonna make you're gonna name it click sound. Okay. So then you're gonna add two local scripts. The the scripts are different though. This is the first script. You can pause the video. Okay. This is the second script. You can pause the video here. Okay, and the rest is just a button. Yeah, the button you see. Okay, so once you're done with those two buttons, you you on you're gonna make a, another frame. You're gonna add another frame into the intro. And this frame is gonna be for whenever you press like an about button or the settings the settings button for me. So whenever you press the settings button, this frame is gonna appear. I'm gonna show it to y'all real quick. Just get it out. Okay, this is gonna show up for me since this is settings button. And I already made the let's see, I already made the title right there. You don't need to think of that, you just need your customizations like me. And then this is the only text button that you're gonna need to exit out. So in this button, which is this one right here. You can put it as you want. I put mine as red and black. Oh, I forgot to change that. Okay, I put mine like that. In that text button, you're gonna add a, two local scripts actually. And then the sound. In the sound, is this the same one? It's a clicking sound. This is sound ID. Name it click sound. Exactly like that. Or the script is not gonna work. Okay, then on the first script on the first local script 
All of these are local scripts, by the way. Because if you use the script, it's going to show up for other players. And we don't want that. So, the first local script is the exit script. Whenever you press this button, it takes you back in this little nice animation. And I'm going to change this to another color so it shows better. Okay, let's put it to that. Alright, the exit script is this one. You can pause the video. Alright. And then the sound script, which is whenever you click the button, it does a little clicking sound. This is the, this is the script. Pause the video. Okay, alright. So, now we're going to go back. And that's pretty much it. There's nothing much. There's not, there's any, there's not anything else. And if you want another, and if, if you want another, another, like, thing like this for the about or a shop. Do the same thing as the settings. Just add another frame. Alright. So let me put this back. Okay. Let's put it to yellow. Okay, now I'm going to show it to you again. Okay, so once you press the settings, this shows up, and I changed that, not the actual back. And whenever you press this, it goes back. And whenever you play, it goes up like that. So, and if you guys don't know what you're doing, please don't change the starter. Let's see. Try not to change the... Where is it? Try not to change this. Because then you're going to mess it up. Okay, so 